Now let's come with the final step here of our scene, which is the final render. Until now, all the particles that we did here, or most of them, will not be rendered. I need to add here uh, the scale, or after the scale. No, no, no. After the scale. Yes. I need a mesh operator. This mesh operator will not change anything. The only benefit of this operator is that it will make you render or capable of rendering these particles. Okay. Now let's uh, press MN to go to the particles. Sorry. Here yeah, uh, to the uh, material. I already have the material, but let's come here and recreate these materials so click me right click uh, materials v-ray and come on you will have your very very I don't see it yes v-ray material come close I'll just choose the type the spline which it have already the mesh so I just need to connect this material with it assign the material and let's come to change the operators of the material just one minute let's choose another color for example to be light green like that Okay, something like that, or anything you want. Uh, for the reflection, um, I need a V-ray maps. Okay, let's take V-ray. for no picture for example okay and let's take the pick um let's make it point four mm. okay stay a five and I need another one shape right Okay. Let's just change the color, sorry, to something else. Something else. Something like that. Let's make it like that, for example. Okay, glossiness for about 85. Okay, and this glossiness, sorry, about 75, for example. Uh, this one I need to assign it to the floor or to, sorry, the, the flowers. So I need here to play a little bit, just even 20 frames. To have something, I need to, yes, I need to have this. Yeah, this. Okay, the blue and click the material and just assign it to them. See? Now let's just play a little bit and take a still render to see how it will look like when rendering. Mm, now I have something here. 
could be render so stop okay and C in order to have to go to the camera and shift F to go to the frames and now before doing anything control S to save everything and go to the render frame I'll pause until I finished and I'll be back. Here is the final render as we see here. The uh, both came to the render, the splines and also the final particles. You can make more of this effect in only five minutes, maybe less. So now we know that we uh, after we finish here our scene, we understand a lot about the events here doing some splines doing some effect doing some um, bending effect to achieve uh, this final scene uh, as i said before i i will upload this scene for you uh, for the description of the first video of this uh, lecture hope you enjoy it if you enjoy it hopefully like it and subscribe and i will uh, see you in the next video.